And now, some word about a typical organ of the Frescobaldi time. This organ was built, made by Catarinozzi. Catarinozzi was an organ builder, uh, origin, which originated in the, a little bit south of Roma. Um, and he used to work in Roma. And here we are a little bit north from Roma. But anyway, not a big distance, maybe 80 kilometers. And uh, the typical Italian organ in, of that time has a principale, which is very sweet.
typical Italian early organ, something closer to the voice than uh, to one orchestra or to one noisy object. Um, a few words about the tuning. And the tu this tuning is called mean tone in English, tono medio in Italiano. Too difficult now to, or too far to explain, but maybe you notice that the last chord of this E, ma e major, the tuning is not four, four, zero, but this is E major for the keyboard. Has one third very, very narrow, or so very, very exact as a third. It's not a typical waving third like in the piano or like in the, our organ Sazzo. This is the well temperated, so 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 called well temperated tuning. This tuning uh, has a big distance with the normal actual well temperated tuning. I can show some example, maybe we can see. Uh, if the this bar goes right, it means the key uh, sounds higher, uh, except stays, key is like in the equal reference, and left means lower note. C stays, C sharp, goes left, so low, very low, left and quick. D. A little bit low. D flat, so me, uh, D, D sharp, me flat. Very high. Me. Quite low. Fa, high. Fa sharp. Low. G. Quite exact. G sharp. Very low. La. Low. B flat. High. To B. Finished. Uh, it means my chromatic scale is very unregular. Expressive thing because each chord composed using the so irregular notes has a different character. So the different character is not given by the pitch higher or lower, but the different character is given by different nature of interval between each note or couple of notes or triple of notes. La bemolle, la flat major. Third chord, uh, B major. One more remark on the first octave. 
with more syllables, so more undecidable, which is Do, C, flat, Ba, O. It sounds me. So it appears to be G sharp, but it's an E. Not here. So I go downstairs where I have the Subaldi Tocatas and I come back. Ah, one remark, more remark. Here I show the Voce Humana, this wavy stuff, uh, but in the time of Fresco Baldi it was more com common in Roma to have the tremolo, so something. Uh, making uh, a device making the wind in unstable in the instrument and um, so creating a quite similar effect this kind of waving this human feeling human emotions showing um, shaking like a uh, year now this is Cata Quinta so to listen to this ripieno maybe with contrabassi maybe not I, I, I'll see uh, if too heavy or not. I will discover, maybe I will change it. <laughs> And the 
white comes back, uh, ready to go to the F section. Sentences like uh, the, the beat shouldn't be uh, regular, but uh, it must be like we are, um, we, uh, we, we can listen, we can hear in the modern madrigals, like in the Monteverdi pieces, uh, or languida or veloce, he says. Sometimes slow, but not only slow, languida is a language. Or quick, so the, 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 the metronome, uh, but the tactus, the, 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 the pulse, goes according to the personal emotion. Like in the middle se section, I was weaker and I was showing this contrapuntal idea. Like...
I must be very careful not to make the camera fall down. Yes, I succeed. So this is the organ. And why not a uh, quick look inside? I don't know if the light is in half. Maybe in automatic mode, maybe. I try to switch automatic mode. I don't know how to do. Impossible, but I try with a small trick. This is the key action. This is the manual activation of the instrument is also possible. And now, yeah, one overview to the church, why not? Santa Scolastica in Rieti. Ah, this is the organ inside. And now we step down. Here the organ. Oh. Sorry, focus again. <laughs> 